if you've ever purchased mango from your local supermarket and you see that the mango originates from Bangladesh. There is a high chance that the mango you purchase from your local supermarket that is coming from Bangladesh was somehow sorted in this market. This is the mango paradise of the world. I have never seen a market as big as this that is dedicated to mangoes. Like, if you go to a market, there's a section for fruits. Some people go for apples, bananas, but in this market, you cannot find any other fruit other than mangoes. It's just fascinating. And it goes all the way there, all the way there. One kilometer long, as they say. It's dedicated to mangoes. This is Amropali. Amropali season. This is what? Firstly. So we have firstly. Let's go for Amropali and other species. Okay? Yes, Amropali. Amropali? Amropali Mojar? 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 Okay. He's saying that Amropali is very tasty. Ah. So let's go. Let's let's go check out Amropali. How are you? <laughs> I think he's excited about my hair. Trying to make a gesture about my hair. So now we're going to look out for Amropali. Maybe it has a name in English, but I don't know. They have their own local names, Bengali names. So let's go check out Amropali. This is Amropali. This is Amropali. What a guy. All right, basically his mangoes are green, not ready to eat yet. What is it? He's collecting a leaf plant. He's collecting ripe ones. This is leaf Remember, this is not colored. Ah. This uh, this quality has no color. No color. No color. Oh. This is like. A it's interesting. It says inside has no color. Yes. Can I try one? Yes, yes. They gave it to test you. To, to taste? Yes, yes. Oh, don't know bad. Don't know bad. <laughs> so I'm going to taste, taste this. Can I wash it? This one? Oh, yeah. I think this one is right. Yeah. Hello, big bite. Bite directly. Yes, yes. So let's try this. You said it has no color. It has color. This is red. Inside. Oh my goodness. Onik moja. Mojar Mojar. Ami Bangladesh Balobashi. Very fine mango. I've never eaten anything like this before. I don't even know how to describe the taste. It looks like I've got some crowd again. But whatever, I'm just gonna enjoy my mango. This video already you're watching is on YouTube, so I most likely will end up somewhere on YouTube or on the local media. Who cares? We will buy this mango. Yeah, 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 yeah we're we'll collecting uh, three or five kg. Yeah. Uh, oh my goodness. We'll go monitoring with Don't know about it. Don't know about it. Thank you, sir. I'm hungry since morning, haven't had food. But this mango, oh my goodness. Yeah, that's hungry.
So we're gonna try the second species of the of the day. And that species is called what? Guti, guti mango. Guti mango. Guti am. Am is mango. So guti am. Um, I'll see how good it is, then probably we'll buy one kilogram. I'll check it out, then we can buy one kilogram from here. You can check. Okay, I want to try it. Good tiam. Apparently, the first mango I ate was a kind gesture from the man, from the seller. It was for free. But I love that mango, so we bought like um, five kilograms to share with his people in his village. So we're going to your village, right? Okay. Alright, let's try this. Also good, but the first one is better, a bit sour. The first one is still winning. Maybe I should, I should try Fosley next. Uh -huh. Guti yam, guti mango. Moja, moja. Or nik moja. The kind of attention I'm drawing in this market. And in the whole country, of course. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Say hello. 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 <laughs> mm. The traffic is crazy. I can look back. I'm obviously the first black guy here in this market. I can bet you on that. Or maybe the first today, or maybe the first this year. So the kind of attention I'm drawing, I haven't really seen it before. The next species is Fosley. Fosley. Oh, this looks so fresh, huh? It looks so fresh. Uh, Koto Kaka. Paso. Uh, what is Paso? You said Paso. What is Paso? Paso. 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 Would cost us 500 taka. Okay, punch show. Yes, a punch show. show. Oh, he called it pasho. So uh, you got me confused. So punch is five and show is hundred. Five hundred. Not very long ago in Europe, I bought a mango like this size, nine euros, nine. But over here, I'm gonna buy all this for 500 taka. 500 taka is believe me, it's less than four euro. Ah, all of all of this. So, do you have people in your village who will eat this? Huh? Huh? We can buy. We can buy. We can buy. Okay, let's take it. Okay, you have a deal. <laughs> the young man got himself a deal. It's a lot of mangoes. What you're seeing is what is on the superficial. There are still more on So we, uh, we purchased all this. Yeah. Uh, there is around uh, uh, 10 kg of mangoes. 10 kilograms. Uh, 10 kilograms of one, and uh, they take for 500 taka for this. Okay, let's go for it. Thank so, punch your taka, yeah? Yes. Uh, I have 500 taka. Wait, I will pay him because I have, I have some change. Okay, punch your taka. This is 1,000. Okay. How are you? You good? Okay, let's go. Let's go. He'll bring it. Yeah? Okay. See you. 
See you in the tuk-tuk. Very happy. <laughs> He's asking if I'm happy. The smell of mangoes in the air, the smell of mango nectars in the air will already get you high, will already tell you where you are. As opposed, when you get into a market like this, maybe a rural market, you will see probably or smell probably smell of spices and smell of other things in the market like animals or fruits. But here it's only mangoes. Salam! <laughs> Interesting car or truck. I don't know what to call that, but maybe I will call it a truck. I've seen all sort of engineering here. They convert maybe some diesel engines made for tractors into running cars, as opposed to Europe, where where I live, of course, obviously, where probably one technical error in your BMW you will knock you off road. You won't be able to drive. But here, everything on two wheels, three wheels is roadworthy. <laughs> <sighs> Obviously, I'm very happy. Mangoes are coming into the market. I'm going out as well. A lot more mangoes down there. Still trying to make their way to the market. And it's about 4 p.m. Market is closing, I believe. But still, business is running. So, I want to try my Fosley. Where is my Fosley? Okay, sir, I think you have my first leaf. Yes, that is my first leaf. Thank you. I will try my first leaf. <laughs> I washed it earlier on, so let's try this mango. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Hello, how are you? Fine. <laughs> so I tell you, if you're watching from eastern part of Nigeria and you know what we call German mango, this is German mango Pro Max. No two ways about it. The taste, the flavor, the texture, 100%. But this is bigger and maybe juicier and the skin just falls out of the seed and melts in your mouth. German Mango Pro Max. Mojar? Onik Mojar. Onik Mojar. Everybody's enjoying their mango. Happy. Mojar? Give him some. Give him some. He doesn't want? Well, he... He lives on mango, so maybe he doesn't want one. Mojar, Mojar? That is our driver. Mission Impossible. Let me mishki. Let me mishki. The Mission Impossible driver, he was great on the highway. I mean, controlling this guy wasn't an easy task. So, thank you, sir, for bringing us here safe and probably taking us back safe. All right, I will enjoy my mango and don't go away. The next mango species of the day, I think the third or the fourth, party four. So, let's see how it tastes, sir. Mishti? Oh, Mishti means sweet. Say it's sweet. Did you see? This is like an apple. Ah, it, it has the shape of an apple. Yeah. Mojar? Mishti Mojar? Mojar Mojar. Mojar Mojar. It's interesting the kind of knife they use. And the edge of that knife looks soiled or dirty, I don't know. But. Oh, packet. All right, Myra, so we're not going to die today. Okay. <laughs> Finally. Hey, don't like it,
What's the name? This is Bali Four. Bali Four. Bharo, you are Bharo. This is another another dish. Interesting, but it's not ripe. It's not ripe. This is not ripe, and this is not tasty. Okay, I give it to this guy. Enjoy. <laughs> My mango. Thank you. Thank you, boy. Back to mine. Allah Hafiz. They were watching me eat this mango from zero to maybe 50. And a traffic over here. Yes. Yes. How are you? Good. How are you? Onik uh, Moja. Moja Moja. Fosli Moja. Fosli. Yeah. Yeah. Tomar Bari? No. No. Okay. Tomar Bari? No, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> I caused traffic. People stopped going to the market. Stopped their regular or daily or usual activity to focus on me. Okay, I'm going to hobe. I've said it many times, but... Enjoy with us too. Wait, wait, wait. You okay? You want to have all of it? Go for it. Mm -hmm. Good boy. This will go to more traffic. Mm. Okay. No, no. She only this. Um, I know. I know. She's not afraid. Ah. Mm -hmm. You see? She eats. Mm. She's not afraid. Mm. Okay. I keep it for you. Enjoy your dinner. Enjoy it. So this young man says he wants to appear in my YouTube and I'm going to do him that favor. Tomar Namki? Muhammad Mashale. Muhammad Mashale. So he wants to be in my YouTube channel. And your wish is granted. You will be in my YouTube soon, okay? All right. All right. Bye bye. <laughs> That lady there was sharing mangoes with me. She's not afraid. <laughs> went mango hunting, got to the village, went into adventure, got to the market, explored, bought mangoes, tasted mangoes, different species I've never had in my life before. As a mango lover, I cannot be in this country where they cultivate mangoes and not be able to taste mangoes. But sadly, or maybe happily, this is summing up my tour in uh, Kanset. Kanset is 85 kilometers from Rajshahi, where the train stopped us. You saw my trip to Rajshahi. Like, comment, of course, share this video, and most importantly, subscribe, right? If you are seeing my channel for the first time, for example, if you are a Bangladeshi living abroad or living in Bangladesh, make sure you like my videos, share them, most importantly, subscribe. If you're watching from anywhere else or you've been glued to my channel, thank you for watching always. Comment, like, and let me know what you think about this video. Alright, it's time to hop into this tuk tuk once more and find our way to Russia. Don't go away. See you when I see you.
going back home we stopped in this mango garden where most of the mangoes we've been eating come from I can see but I'm not sure I'm allowed to touch so I just want to share with you guys where most of the mangoes you eat come from and that's it my crew and gang over there and myself bringing you the show for today I thought it was gonna be a goodbye but not yet so we are in this remote village of Kansek in Bangladesh oh my goodness I'll tour a village proper proper tomorrow for today we dedicated all the whole journey to mangoes as you've seen oh yeah stick around fellas and don't go away <laughs> Cross, but it's a bit dangerous. I want to say hi to these guys. They are one of the hardest working people in Bangladesh. What's that for me? Salam, 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 salam. I like your your shop. Very good, very good. Making bed for I don't know future clients or maybe taking orders. And also kind of creating another attention in this village. What kind of palm is that? Alright, let's go. Turning around? Okay. Our Uber is turning around. Okay, we keep exploring. Make sure you don't go away. So we are approaching the highway once more. We are back to civilization. The highway is just literally 100 meters away. I will wrap up this village episode here. Hope you liked it. Of course, remember, like this video, share and subscribe. And most importantly, don't forget that I will see you when I see you. More episodes coming. Make sure you don't go away. See you in the village. Bye for now. Bye.